Hey guys, it's Monday, I'm England and you're watching Project Excellent and uh, this week the topic is body modification. Wow. This kind of covers a whole host of topics, right? I don't know. Tattoos, plastic surgery, which is a big thing, piercings, just generally anything that we do to change our bodies for whatever reason. I'll start with tattoos. I don't really like tattoos. <laughs> I've always sort of struggled with wanting one. Do I, don't I? If I were ever to get one, it would be here. So I have thought about it. It'd be here, along this bit of my arm. It would more than likely say fly, which is kind of embarrassing, but it, it just so that I can always remind myself to fly. Or whatever. Or shine. Or something really retarded and, I don't know, inspirational. I'm not one of these people that preaches to people like, Tattoos are wrong, and you're going to regret that for the rest of your life because you're going to be old and saggy and wrinkly, and this tattoo is going to look awful, and you're going to regret it because I'm not about that. You can do what you want with your life. Um, I just don't like them on myself. I can look at a tattoo as a piece of art on another person and be absolutely amazed and look how beautiful it is and all this wonderfulness, but I can't really. I don't like the idea of having one on me. It's just, I think, the permanent side of it is a bit too much for me to handle. Plastic surgery. Mm. Big, big topic, really. Um, what do I think? Um, let's just go for the aesthetic reasons, the, 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 the reasons that people do it for, for a sort of vanity. Um, now, a lot of people would sort of, I, I'm guessing, uh, presume that I'd be completely against it. However, I'm not. And here's why. I'm all for self-confidence. I think you should be confident with who you are. Right? Okay? Whether you're big, small, you have a massive nose, you don't have a massive nose. But it's easy saying that. For some people, it's, a, it's you know, almost physically, mentally impossible to sort of get over the fact that you look a certain way. So plastic surgery, for me, is a way to get over that. Um... I'm not saying that I myself would... I, I really dislike my nose. But I'm not saying that I would go get rhinoplasty. You know? Again, it's one of these things that I can understand why and I can see why, but I would really struggle with doing it myself. However, I um, went to many consultations with a doctor regarding a gastric band. So... Yeah. I'm, I'm not sort of against it and I don't oppose it in any way because I've considered it myself. Um, I, you know what, I think that's you really, I, plastic surgery to me is, in some cases where the person doesn't really have self-confidence issues and they get it just because they want to mimic someone, I think then that's when it's wrong, it should not be used in that way. But if you have a serious, like, underlying psychological problem because of, say, you have a massive nose, then... I am fully for it. I, I I don't see any problem with it. I do, however, believe that you should grow old gracefully. I don't believe that, for example, Simon Cowell, Dolly Parton, I don't believe that you should iron out every wrinkle as it appears, because I think that's wrong. Sort of contradicting myself there, but it, it makes sense in my head. And another note, uh, Claire, I, haven't, I have not commented on you being on the channel yet, and I feel I was looking back through my videos and I felt really awful because I'm s s stoked that you're here. I'm so excited that you're on the channel now. Uh, you know, another person from the UK and all that, so yay! I'm really happy your videos have been amazing so far. <laughs> Love the tattoo on your foot. Uh, I really, really do. Uh, you see, I can, I can appreciate it. I just couldn't have one myself. Um, yeah, I've got my person for the Secret Santa. Mum's here. Well, I'll see you next week. <laughs> Bye.